Hey guys, thanks for stopping in for another video. Today we're going to be playing Master of Puppets. Not to be confused with that cassette tape in your dad's Bronco. This is an indie horror game made by one guy. Uh, I think his name is Tony. His his handle on Steam is Tony Dev. <laughs> so I haven't really looked into his, into his company yet or his, his backlog of games that he's, he's made. But this game actually looked like it took a lot of effort and he put a lot of thought into it it looks like a genuinely good game i know i usually play like horrible horrible trash horror games just for the fun of it but like this game genuinely looks good so we're gonna dive into this i'm gonna play it for about 30 minutes or so i don't want to spoil everything so if you think this game looks cool go ahead and like give this guy 12 bucks it's really not that much money for a genuinely good game or so i'm assuming it i mean it, it looks good There he is, Jack Holmes. Jack, reach around. Whoa, okay. Damn, this actually looks kind of good. We mess with the options here, do a little V-Sync and all that jazz. All right, yeah, this this actually looks kind of tight. I've had such a good nap. I've had such a good nap, mate. Oh, I might, I've had such a good nap. Jesus, is that the is that the carpet making that sound? <laughs> this dude needs to shampoo this shit. This guy is definitely a bachelor. He is living the bachelor life. Look at that that mirror. <laughs> okay, hold up, hold up. Actually, that's not that's not a bad effect. Never mind. I'm I'm clowning, but like that's not a bad effect. I'm surprised that he even went like the length to make a, a mirror effect. A lot of people just like breeze past that shit. Ooh, that's the catcher's sock. Is that his doggo? Oh, how do I interact with it? Bimba, my best friend. Bimba. Dude, what are those people out there sound kind of scary. All right, let's get the show on the road. Wait, can I play the git? Can I play the git? All right. You know, I'm not gonna lie. This is actually a really cozy little apartment. I kind of like this. Damn, he's got the... What trophy is that? <laughs> ah, yes, human. Great book. I was up until late yesterday looking at flights to Japan, but I have no money. Damn, dude. How immersive. Bavario. What's going on? Can I punch that clown? Uzo the clown. <laughs> Uzo. <laughs> Is he related to Ivan Ooze? Hi, honey. I'm home. Uh, I really want to go to this theme park. Damn, those macaroons. I don't know what it is about macaroons, because, like, whenever you have a macaroon, like, they're okay. They're not bad, but they always look so damn good. Oh, he's a skater boy. Hmm, I don't know if that's copyright or not. I don't have to go anywhere. I should take a shower. Oh, okay. So, uh, guess we're gonna take a shower. He's got the poker set. How I miss playing games with my friends. Oh, me too, Jack. Me too, buddy. Uh, is this the shower room? Yeah, looks like a shower room to me. Get that old light. Uh. Oh no, they're gonna catch me slipping. Just a minute. All right. Um, is this my invitation to Uzo the Clown World? Good morning, Jack. I finally have a case for you. This is your first case, although it doesn't seem very difficult. You are to investigate the disappearance of a man named Frederick R. The tip-off was given by his sister, who claims that she noticed something strange about him on a phone call and fears that he has done something crazy. 
Since then, she has not been able to locate him, and as she lives in France, she is unable to tra travel to the United States to locate him. We know that Frederick is a woodworker and lives in a secluded house in the woods near the town of St. John. Not little St. John, just regular St. John. Big St. John. With his wife and nine-year-old daughter in Louisiana. Oh, wait, no, I was thinking of St. James. Never mind. I'm a dummy, dude. I would have I would have fucked that I would have fucked that Epstein case up already. Go there as soon as you can try and relocate him. I remind you that per data protection policy towards our clients, we cannot use digital means to communicate or bring firearms to investigations. I should also warn you that our colleague David has also gone there to investigate the case. If you get in touch with him, he could give you an update. By the way, I'm glad you finally decided to follow in your great great grandfather's footsteps and take up the same trade. Take care. Kind regards, your Aunt Lauren Adler. I don't know where this guy is at, but I actually used to do private investigator work. I worked as a private investigator for like two years, and I was able to carry a gun. Oh, let's shoot the J. Let's shoot the J. Yo, Uzo, up top. Oh, that was really, really anticlimactic there. Uzo, up top. Can I not throw this thing? Oh, cool. That was, that was a fun game of b-ball. Uh, yeah, let's go to Frederick's house. Okay, right off the bat, I'm noticing that the load screens are really, really long. Uh, for a second, I thought my game broke there, and also during the first load screen when I first started the game. Might need to be optimized a little bit. So this is Jack Reach Around, huh? Doesn't, doesn't look all that cool. All right. I should think about washing the car. Yes. Yes, you should. It's very unprofessional. I'm not going back the way I came. Is that the way I drove it? I Damn, I drove across this bridge with that thing. This guy's ballsy. Okay, can I jump this log? All right. And a walking we will go. Well, here we are. I'll take you new to Frederick's house. Let's see if it doesn't take too long and I find this guy soon. I feel like I'm not going to like what I find here. Dude, I'm kind of jello of Frederick. I would love to live out in the sticks like this. Hey. I don't think there are many people living around here. Frederick lives right next to a theme park. That's or an amusement park. That's pretty cool. The only time I, I ever go to amusement parks is when the fucking carnival comes into my small town. <laughs> like that, that, those rides, I don't know. I see, I see way too many like videos of people getting maimed on those rides. I mean, we, you know, we all still ride them because they're fun, but one of these days it's going to be my downfall. That's how I, that's how I feel. Either that or cancer. <coughs> Hell yeah. I should think about quitting smoking. I think you need to be able to smoke in more games. This is really, really cool. Dude, like, yeah, if you just, if you lived here, and you should walk down the trail in the, in the morning or at night, whatever, do you like have a cup of coffee? Just like look over the, over the hill here and just watch the amusement park. I would love that so much. I bet he lives in a tiny ass cabin too. That's like my dream. All right. All right. He has electricity out here. What a long walk. Yeah. He's <laughs> reminds me of those games that are all the rage lately. All those walking sims, huh? He, I bet Jack Could Holmes plays a lot of those. House? That dopey little gnome. That's that's snoozy, dude. Frederick, open up. Yeah, I, I love this. This this would be so cool. Looks like someone had to get out of the house fast. Damn, what's he making? Jambalaya? That shit looks bomb. What's that? These are shotgun shells. I don't need them. That's what you think. 
All right, if he did need them, would he just steal from this this missing man? Oh, but you do need the first aid kit, huh? Yeah, I see the doggo over here. What's up, pup? They've left you without any food, eh? Let's feed him shotgun shells. Damn, he actually isn't even gonna feed that dog. Can I feed him the? Looks like someone nope. had to get out of the house fast. That's a that's a really well behaved dog. Like, I would assume that he'd be all up on this table, like in that nanner and that bread and stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Very interesting. Oh, okay. That's a that's a save. All right. Very interesting. Oh uh, yeah, Frederick uh, ain't here, boss. Is he down the road? It's very dark. Fireflies. Use the flashlight. Oh, Jesus! What was that? Oh, that is the worst flashlight I have ever seen. It doesn't even do anything. I'm out of large first aid kits. Just trying to figure out the buttons do here. This must be Frederick's house. Taking you to Frederick's house. Oh, but it's chained up. Then there must be another way in. Yeah, through the woods, right? Through the dark, scary woods. I mean, until you've encountered something like supernatural, I guess this shit probably wouldn't scare you if you're a tough guy. I'm a tough guy. Ooh, let's get that ax. We're gonna need that ax. Wait, so this is not Frederick's house. He actually, ha he has neighbors or is that, does that little house belong to the people who own this big house? Oh shit, overlooking the lake, look at that. Yeah, this would, this place would be kind of creepy to live at. It would be amazing, but you would always have like a little bit of pensiveness, I feel. Hey, look, the phone. All right, let's save it. Is that a tongue? No, it's a leaf. That old TV, that, that's cool as hell. I love that. Those old analog TVs are dope. Uh, yeah, Frederick's gone, guys. Frederick is just gone. What's up with that mannequin over there? What's up, little buddy? Nothing, huh? One of those uh, pose drawing dolls. Oh, okay, here we go. Dear Mr. Frederick, please do not throw garbage into the lake. The debris piles up and ends up floating on the surface. You should also check the sewer under your house in the lake. As you hear strange noises at night, perhaps an animal has sneaked in again. Sincerely, the forester. You should also check the sewer under your house in the lake closed i will have to look for another way in okay so now i'm officially breaking into this guy's house which <laughs> i know like I, I said that like carrying a gun at least where i live was like okay to do um you could not trespass or break into somebody's house regardless of what you're like what kind of case it is this is totally illegal so he should have just brought a fucking gun ah yes Is that a, is that a chrysalis? Here we go. Storm doors? No, I can't get in the storm door. What about... Can I climb a trellis or something? I feel like I'm like locked in this area now since I've jumped over that gate. I don't really, I don't really see another way in. Maybe I need to do a little more exploring around here. Where's the, where's the hidden key under the, under the doormat? All right, maybe I have to go in from the lake. 
Sounds crazy, I know. But they said that there was like a sewer. Oh, yeah, here we go. Uh, hold up, hold up. I just want to see what this looks like. Ooh. These, these colors are cool. All right. We are in the house. Or in the sewer under the house. I could use the flashlight. You could. Is this all blood? Is this all blood, mate? All right. Ah, damn, dude. Who has all this under their house? Like, I go down. I go down in my basement. And I'm like a little confused by like some of the like the duct work and the pipes. Like, I can imagine having like a whole dungeon. We got like an incinerator, like a generator, probably a dead kid there. That that is like the size of a child's body. That's that's a that cage is the side of a size of a child's body too. Uh, I don't think Frederick was a good guy, unless this is the Forester's house. I think this is Frederick's house. Damn, was he feeding him dog food? Oh, a little little bone, dude. A little sausage. At least I hope that's a sausage. Oh man, that's bright as hell. Poor creature. How awful. That wasn't a creature. That was a fucking. That was a human, dude. Just like in your books. Uh, yeah. These were all children, dude. What the fuck is happening? This game actually got really dark. <laughs> like, I thought it was going to be kind of an arcadey, like. Sir. What the fuck was that? Child sized coffin. Damn, they actually took it there. You don't. S What's the candle about? What the fuck is this? It's like an asylum. What the fuck is this place? Yeah, no shit, Jack Holmes. You're the investigator here. That's a that's a that's a red herring. That's that's nothing right there. Yeah. I've played enough horror games. The next one might not be though. Those footsteps. Holy shit. Uh, I think it's time to go. What the fuck is this dude doing? Was he eating kids? Oh, there's like brains in there. There's a... That is the biggest heart I have ever seen. What the fudge? What the fuck is that? Disgusting. I'm actually getting the heebie-jeebies a little bit. Dude. This shit's nuts. It's not the first time I've seen this child and her mother. What? <laughs> well, I, I don't remember ever seeing those two. I could take the revolver if it wasn't in pieces. Put it back together, Jack. I could take the revolver if it wasn't in pieces. It looks like it, all the pieces are right there. You got the hammer, the revolver, the cylinder. Like, uh, it looks like all the pieces are right there, buddy. Hot glue gun, a camera. All kinds of tools and a sewing machine. Damn, dude, what was this guy doing? Whoa! That's a mannequin. Was he trying to... Dude, was he, like, trying to Five Nights at Freddy these mannequins and, like, put kids, like, souls in them? Wood, organs, bones. This shit is actually nuts. This is really cool. Whoa! What the hell are these puppets? Yeah, I, I didn't think this game was going to be this serious. Hey, there's that key. Is that for the house? Look at her. She's kind of a cutie. I kind of like that she's in a wheelchair. Wheelchairs are hot. I didn't, I didn't, I was just kidding, guys. Wheel I mean, wheelchairs aren't, aren't not hot. There's a note. 
The very potent poison found in the strange spiders in the caves of the slaughter gulch mines has advanced my investigations in an extraordinary manner. The enzyme contained in this poison quickly corrupts the flesh of the infected subject and produces almost immediate muscular rigidity. But if the antigen is isolated and adjuvants are applied, we achieve the opposite effect, preventing the flesh from rotting and managing to regenerate it while maintaining the rigidity, which is the desired objective. On the other hand, the problem with the marrow persists. The calcium corrodes rapidly, leading to ligament ruptures, bone splinters, bleeding of vital organs, and internal tears. Internal? Oh, tears. Jesus. <laughs> They're crying on the inside, dude. <laughs> this results in a rapid and incredibly painful death. I must find a solution. I think I have an idea, but I must continue to run tests on the wood. Wow, okay. So he was trying to he was trying to use these parasites. I gotta read that shit. Nah, I'm gonna I'm gonna read this in post. I'm not gonna come to any conclusions right now because I'm a dummy. But I think that he's trying to combine these parasites with these puppets here to bring them a lot. All right, hold up. I'm gonna read. It. I'm, I won't make you guys read it again. Yeah, what what is it, the actual experiment though? Oh no. Oh no, that thing's alive. Please let me put this gun together, please. I could take the revolver if it wasn't in pieces. Fuck, I don't dude, I I can't defend myself. Ooh, that that little that little flute scale, I like that. That was, ooh. Oh shit. Yeah, that one broke out. Okay. There's more of them. Oh no. Don't do it, please. Oh shit. That fucking mannequin just knocked me through the floor. All right, all right, all right. We got another one right there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sneak up on her, give her the old solid snake chokehold. Yep, we're in predator mode now. Oh, I, I likely want to go around this thing. Yeah, I probably can't fight it yet. Oh. Wish you would have just taken those revolver parts, bro. God damn. This is a this is horrifying. Oh god, I hate that. I, I hate the I hate the the schisming. That freaks me out so much. I, I think I was scarred as a kid from that remake of House on the Haunted Hill. How like every time you saw a ghost in the camera, they were like doing that really fast like shake schism. Like that movie used to freak the hell out of me. That was probably the one movie that scared me the most as a kid. Yeah, oh, I hate this. They're all gonna come out of there too. I know it. All right, we got the makeup counter. Maybe if we just pretty them up a little bit. They won't hate us so much. Okay, we're keeping that candle on. Although I feel like that's probably gonna work against us at some point. So we'll wanna be enshrouded. Are those tentacles? What are those? Oh no, those are arms. Okay. <laughs> oh God. Oh God, those are those spiders, dude. Oh God, I hate those, dude. I, I I wouldn't say I'm arachnophobic, but oh, I just man, spiders are so f fucking disgusting. What are you trying to grab me for, pervert? You prevert? Oh man, okay, okay, okay. Wait, is this the way that I was looking down, where the the doll was sitting? I can't really tell. This is this place is pretty labyrinthian. Oh god, here we go. Okay, they're giving us a gun. They're giving us a gun. And it starts. I don't have this weapon. I'll keep the ammo. I think it's a great idea, cuz. Can I read this note? 
Frederick has gone mad. He doesn't listen to reason. The death of his little daughter seems to have traumatized him forever. He is a violent and unpredictable person. It's a madhouse up there. Experiments on small children, puppets that move by themselves, giant spiders. If you read this, run away from here and don't go up to that house. I've broken my leg coming down here to escape, but it's too late for me. Tell my wife I love her. Signed, David. Dude, this is straight Resident Evil. I, li I like this a lot. This is so fucking cool. Now, oh, give me more ammo, please. All right, hold up. Can I, like, get rid of that head bob? Deactivate head bobbing. Yeah, we're just gonna... Okay, cool. We're good. All right. And that was David. Damn, he fucking splattered his brain on the walls. I'm very sorry, David. Damn, they killed his little girl, dude. These motherfuckers are gonna pay. As soon as I get out of here and call the police. Oh, no. They let him out. Oh, mother. This gun's not great. This gun's not great. I seriously just died of the first enemy. I'm not this bad, guys. The gun was clunky. This gun was very clunky. All right, we're gonna fucking get that spider this time, though. Do I, like, can I shoot that barrel? Didn't do anything. Didn't do anything. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it did. Those spiders are tough. Those spiders are tough as hell. I do not like this. I do not like this at all. What the fuck, man? Imagine being this guy, like chained down here in this dungeon. Fucking the other wall is right in front of you, like two feet away. You just, ugh, the spiders like skittering around. Yep, look at that. Look at this one. That, that one's gonna fucking jump scare me. I'm not dumb. All right, maybe, she, maybe she's not. Damn, she dropped her spine. Oh God. Oh no. Don't grab me. Damn, she's kind of a cutie too. Is there a fetish for that? Mannequins? Oh fuck. Please die, please die. Woo, I think I got her. Okay. Oh man. Yeah, okay, so I'm pretty sure that was the one that was sitting there. She just fucking busted through that wall like she didn't fucking, she didn't give a fuck. All right, who's next? Who's next? Yeah, that's the way I came from, okay. I got the key, I got the gun. Is there another one behind me? Oh, I thought there was for a second. Wait, how am I even gonna get back up? Cause I got fucking shoved through a uh, floor. Oh, there's a ladder. Was this here the whole time? Use the ladder, bro. Oh, okay, that was weird. We got this. Oh, no. Do I... Where's my key at? Basement key, use. What am I doing? Help? Why isn't this working? Basement key. Use object. I. This is the right key, isn't it? It has to be. Wall hacks. Oh, I thought it was gonna work too. Okay, for real though, like why isn't why isn't this working though? Okay, we got it, we got it. Oh god, okay. 
That one's coming alive. That one's gonna come to life. I don't trust anything in here. Dude, just let me just let me take the revolver. What if I find all the pieces? I could take the revolver if it wasn't in pieces. Okay. Whatever. We don't need a revolver. It's not like we don't it's not like we Oh no. You're not gonna do this to me. Oh shit! That thing got me. They pulled the rope a dope. Okay, do I shoot this lock off? They fucking rope a dope me back there. Oh, it's too dark. It's too dark. All right, where are we now? Hey, survive the basement. Okay, so now we are out of the sewers and we are like in the actual basement of the house as a first aid kit and that is mine. Damn, I kind of wish that they made like... Oh, I thought they, these were like square cans. Never mind, just the way that the light's hitting them. Square cans could be a cool thing. I feel like you're gonna like get botulism pretty easy, but I feel like they, they would break on the seams a little too easily. Damn, a square can just sounds kind of tight. All right, what's up with this lathe? It looks like woodworking machinery. Hello? Okay, we got another note here and a phone. Lately, you have been late in sending material. We have been sending you payments on a regular basis, but the material is taking too long to arrive at the circus. Please, if you have any problems, do not hesitate to contact me or my brother, Alfredo, in case you need help with a specific issue. We look forward to hearing from you, as our star rides depend on these materials. Sincerely, Bill Fettuccini. It's a Bill Fettuccini. So what materials are they talking about? Are they talking about... Talking about kids? Oh God, dude. What the fuck is that thing? That thing's horrifying. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh, let's save it again. You know, just for fun, because saving is fun. Okay, I hope to God that thing does not come to life. Hello? Sir? Hello, sir? God, she's like crying like right upstairs. Is there like a living child in here? I bet it's a fucking mannequin trying to draw me in. Okay, you want your privacy, I understand. Hell no, we don't. Hell no, we don't take chances. Why are y'all crying? Oh my god, what was it doing? Oh. I wonder... Was this its, like, human body? Oh, fuck. <laughs> was this its human body in this tub and now it's, like, returned to, like, cry about it? Oh, God, what's happening? Am I on fire? Oh, God, it's running. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Like, I already knew it was trying to get me with a window, but that thing came at me quick. Nope. That's a big nope ski from me, brother. I don't have any desire to go any further. Like, at this point, dude, like, just stop the investigation, dude. Why would you continue to do this? I get it. Like you're getting paid, but they're gonna they're gonna pay you after you tell them the story. You you had to go through what? I'm 
I'm afraid these one of these doors are gonna bust open and something's gonna come charging at me again. Oh man. Which door? Which door is it gonna be? Alright, we're gonna shut that behind us. Just to make sure. Is that a red herb? No! 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 Please don't make me deal with that. Were they feeding that thing? Okay, get the first aid kit. We're gonna get the first aid pills and the first aid bread as well. What is this switch here? Turn the lights on. How disgusting. Everything is rotten. That fucking, sp whoa, that spider, how did it get away so quick? Where did it even get away to? Yeah, bro, why weren't you looking at it? Uh, it's still coming, it's still coming, it's still coming! Is it taking damage? I can't tell. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah, that was scary and all, but what about that spider? That's what I'm really worried about. No, let's keep those lights on. Let's turn all the lights on. It's like being home alone as a kid. Like, just turn all the lights on in your house. What was he watching? Lost in Rome. That's a classic. Man and his woman. Time to die. This... Whoever lived here has really good taste in movies. Can I, like, watch anything? No, turn that shit back on, bro. We're watching Brave Little Toaster. Let's, uh, let's unlock this door. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's one of those haunted doors. This, what? Who are these people? Oh, shit. Let me get that axe, bro. I, can, I don't have infinite ammo. This game is actually pretty freaky. Okay, okay, okay. What, you think I'm dumb? I know that something's gonna come around one of these corners here. Is there a mannequin in this room? Oh god, yes there is. Oh god! That one's tall! I'm glad that they're, like, giving me enough ammo, though. That's kind of nice. Oh, shit. Okay. We're brave. We are brave souls. The fuck? Yeah, what the fuck, though? For real. What the fuck? It's the mastermind. All right, we're going to save it one more time here. It doesn't move. I sure hope it stays that way. Oh God, it's dancing. Nah, we don't dance around here. Okay, okay. We are brave. That one's gonna come to life, dude, I know it. We're brave. We are brave souls. Nothing, huh? Oh, okay. So they start on fire and like that's how they dissipate. That's how they get rid of the bodies in this game. Not upstairs. Bro, trying to hide over there in the shadows. I don't think I don't think you can damage them until they like get activated. Oh shit, that one's got red eyes. 
She's got the red eyes. Yeah, burn in hell. Burn in hell, you freak. Ugh. I'm not looking forward to like when I have to encounter that giant spider though. That's what I'm really nervous about. Thought I heard that door open down there. Okay, okay, no, we got this. We are brave big boys. We are big brave boys. Oh God, it's like contorting. Oh God, it's the unholy lock. What uh? Okay, you have to shoot it. Okay, my bad. See, that's one of the big ones. That's one of the big ones. I'm glad. Oh, I was just gonna say, I'm glad they go down with like a headshot, though. Ooh, what's up, bro? Ah, oh, you hit me. Okay, I'm hurt. I'm hurt a little bit. How do we use the health packs? There we go. I feel like the aim down. I feel like the aim down sights is just a little off. Like. Maybe it's better to shoot from the hip like a bad mother. Ooh, what's up, girl? Thought you'd get the old sneak sneak, huh? Okay. Okay. Damn, we got a little girl's room there. Are they like boarding them up and like teaching them stuff? Like they have a school in here. That's kind of crazy. Uh, world map upside down. Okay. Man. Whoa, that, that was kind of weird. That effect. Hey, what if I turn this light on? What is the point of the lights? I mean, does it, does it really do anything to help? Am I going to see like some secret code like on the wall that I wouldn't have normally seen? Okay. Okay. So is there... There's gotta be some kind of secret here. Like that? That looks like a secret to me. Dude, he had... Okay, it was like a, like a mechanical lock on the door. Whoa. This guy was fucking sick. He had this place set... No! I know you're not the only one. Yep, I knew you weren't the only one. Where's the other one at? I feel really bad because I don't know if these are like little girls or what. Okay, if these are like real people. Okay, I see some more eyes. Ooh, shit, she didn't like that. Oh shit, why did I reload? Why did I reload? That was bad. Yeah, see like the, the aim down sights doesn't I I think it's like off. It's not it's not aligned. Okay, so like alright, right here. We're aiming at that thing on the wall. That is so far off. That is so far off. So the aim down sights doesn't really help at all. Eyes wide open. Oh man. Starring Calm Truce. What the f No. No. What is that sound? Okay, is that one? That one's wheelchair bound. I mean, she's probably not getting up to hurt nobody. Oh, God. Please tell me you kept bullets in the little girl's room. I feel like something's gonna jump out. 
Okay, this key has got to go to the room at the end of the hall. Or maybe one of these rooms, I guess. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, so... Keys to the first floor. Woo! Okay. Okay. One of these doors is gonna open now. I know it. There's gonna be somebody at the top of the stairs here waiting for us. Okay, that door ain't opening. I, I don't, I still don't understand where that, that fucking spider could have like snuck off to. I don't remember seeing a, a locked door down here either that I could necessarily use this key on. Oh God, okay, here we go. Okay, there's spider eggs. This woman in the corner. Okay, okay, okay. There's a giant fucking spider in here, bro. That thing might not be dead. What the hell happens here? Intestines, they tried to flush them? Here? Oh, oh. Okay, so I think that... Thank God she's dead. Yeah, no shit. I think that this key will just go to like pretty much every door down here on the first floor. I don't remember which ones were locked though. Go away from me. Go away from me. That one was creepy. Like the way that its eyes were just like voids. I don't remember seeing that thing in here either. Okay. Okay. Oh, is that her? No. That one still hasn't come to life. Yeah, we're saving it. We save every chance we get. We are not going to get an S rank on this. Okay, can I use that? Can I use that front door yet? Can I just get the fuck out of here, please? No. You can never leave. Alright. Swing that corner a little wide. Yes, okay. Those rooms down at the other end of the hall. This would be a good time to throw a giant spider at me. Oh, I didn't even try going out here. Or in here. We close the door because we're polite. I don't remember being in a laundry room. Or the kitchen, whatever the, this kitchenette laundry room combo. This is kind of a weird layout. Okay, so we cannot leave yet. All right, one of these doors is gonna freak me out. Hello? Hello? Okay, okay. I think we're good in here. It's, all right, this is the time, right? Where we see some... What's a little paper doll man? He's kind of cool. Seems that Frederick based the puppets on a design by Marlene. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Looks like a way out of this hell. How do you figure? I feel like I feel like I am like just like since I'm playing the game, I'm not really like able to like think critically because I can't multitask like that because I'm a dum dum. But I feel like I'm missing something. Village of Ismuth. Haha, <laughs> Lovecraft reference. Here we go. Ten, ten out of ten. Great game. A woman tearing her face off. Yeah. Or maybe she's putting her face on. Marlene and Lisa. What? What am I missing? The unmistakable gaze of puppets. Yes. They fucking they stare right through your right through you. Okay. Freeze! Nope. Yes? No? All right, this is this is the room with the puppets. Maybe not. Maybe I'm safe in here. Okay, that key. Where does that key go to? 
the second floor. All right. Uh, I think we're going to start getting into puzzle territory now. This is some nice furniture. Ooh, I like that receiver. That's awesome. Is that a readable note? No. What were they doing in the pool room? He's like getting drunk and like feeling up this puppet. These are fucking... F are these real puppets? That's, that's, that's thumbnail territory, bro. I was hoping I could hide the, uh... That's thumbnail territory. I like that. Ooh, those are creepy too. I can't tell. Is this AI or, or are these like real puppets that they took photos of? I like what this. A bunch of freaks. This shit is scary, dude. I guess they're prototypes. What the hell? Okay, I got the I got the second story key. I don't think there are any notes in here. Whoo! Okay. 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 That spider is still lurking somewhere. Where is there a puppet that was not animated until or like when I first came through? I know like there's that one in that clock, like that save room. Is this time to shine? Is it your turn now? It doesn't move. Okay, that one's. Wait, hey, what are all these hundreds books? Hundreds and hundreds of books in strange languages. Ooh, they got a cup. They got a copy of the Necronomicon in there. In the Necronom nom, the nom nomicon. Okay, okay, okay. So we can now get into these two rooms. Three rooms. Two rooms? Looks safe. Hey, the light stayed on. Nice. Uh-oh, we got a war hero. Great. It seems that Frederick also knows how to do taxidermy. Are we gonna find a bunch of little stuffed girls like hanging up on his wall somewhere? This shit's cool, dude. Like this Frederick guy could have been a cool guy to hang out with if he wasn't such a fucking creep. What the hell is this thing? For real though, what is that thing? It's like a Wendigo or something. Fucking skinwalker. Yeah, this guy was like in the war. He was really into birds. There we go. That should that that's the first red flag that you knew something was not right with this dude. That's how into birds he was. And and reptiles I guess time to die oh it's a fake book oh okay so this leads into that other room wait why there's a number there there's a keypad so somewhere what the, what the hell is there this is thing? a clue I feel like it has something to do with these here. Dude, let me get that rifle and shotgun off the wall, bro. Are you crazy? Okay, so will this stay open? I have to know the numbers. I do not know the numbers. It's the only way I'm getting into that room. So let's see if we can find a clue in the other two rooms out here. Uh-oh. 
I actually kind of like those lights up there. That's dope. Damn, she got she got the Bigfoot mask too. What is this? Band-aids? What was that? Spare parts for the projectors. Okay, we got to go back downstairs. All right, she's done for. Damn, is that talkie, Tina? Barbara Finch. What's that? My friend, the from the My Friend Bigfoot collection. Girl power. Oh, she, dude, she has some cool little toys like George Washington in a spacesuit. Uh, what the hell were these called? These were a little bit after my time, and I was a, I was a Lego guy. Um, like little, little town or little play town or something. I don't, I don't remember. All right, got the first aid kit. Let me grab it. All right, that's a little finicky. Ah, cat, cat weekly. Andrew Toxic. <laughs> Bro, I fucking go hard on some Andrew Toxic. I haven't seen a mannequin in a little while. Okay, so we've got... What have we gotten here? It's a neat little jewelry stand, I guess. Oh my god. God only knows what happened here. Damn, he had her strapped to the bed. Like, I can't tell where these mannequins are what? Were were these people at some point? I, I think they were. Bro, please let me know down in the comments. Like I I am I just had like a long day of work. My critical thinker is not fucking working right now like if you if you figured anything out let me know down in the comments just a sec all right sorry about that guys i just got a phone call there where were we we were trying to okay we got to go back down to that projector which room was that in got to go down to the projector and I'm, I'm assuming it's going to give us the code that we need to get in to that door. I think for the most part, the coast is clear. Until we hit like the next phase. I'm hoping. Okay, projector room. Here we go. So, do I interact with it? Yeah, okay. 458102. Oh God. Oh, I thought that, I thought that lamp over there was something. 458102, I cannot forget that. What broke? Who got in? Oh shit, this is scary. Oh, here we go, here we go. Lady, go home. I feel like it's not just that one. There's, I feel like there's another one somewhere. Oh, oh, I was right. Oh, God. What does this button do? Hold on. Let me, I, I'm going to check the controls real quick. There's a bash? Some... What does this button do? Oh, maybe it switches my guns whenever I have another gun. Okay. I also did not realize that there was a bash, so that kind of changes things. Dude, I, I swear to God that one's going to come to life. Okay, let's see how this bash works. I'm gonna fucking smack some zombies. I'm gonna smack some mannequins upside the head. 458102. Alright, here we go. 458102. I'm coming. 
covering all my my flanks here. Okay, that one's not coming to life, but that one sure as hell is. No? What about you? Really? Ah. Uh, what? None of them, huh? Unless like they really can't take damage until I like activate them somehow until they get triggered. Y'all getting triggered here? Mmm, smack my bitch up. Yeah, you're lucky. That that shit would have hurt. Oh god, it locked me back in. Okay. Oh, there you are. There you are. Ooh, got her in the belly. I hear that shit hurts. Oh god, there's another one. Oh, oh. Yo, the the bash actually kind of helped. That this shit works. No, no. I can't be. I can't be. I actually need a first aid kit, dude. I'm gonna die. Do I have any? Oh, okay. I, I had a small one, I guess. Oh shit! I didn't know this went back here. What is that? Pogo stick? Let me get it. Hmm. Okay, let's check this room first. How long's that candle been burning up here? These are like infinite eternal candles. All right, so there's a padlock there. I'm gonna need to find the code for that. I don't know. I can't just shoot that shit off, but I guess I will find the padlock code. Dude, I, f I feel like those mannequins downstairs are going to activate. Okay. 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 Got a voodoo doll. Oh, voodoo stuff, typical of this part of the country. What part of the country are we on? In. No, from Frederick. My head is no longer in its place. Loneliness drives me crazy. I miss them so much. The damage I have done is irreparable. Keeping Marlene alive is complicated. Any damage to her heart could kill her, but I need her stem cells for the puppets. I have to go back to the accident site to collect more of Lisa's blood to continue synthesizing serum. The suffering I have caused Marlene is unjustifiable, but I can't forget Lisa, my little Lisa. The darkness of the nights is eternal. I can't tell day from night. The walls talk to me. The puppets won't let me sleep. Please, someone put an end to all this madness. I will never forget that wonderful 2109. I will never forget that wonderful code to the padlock. Damn, so is this guy like trying to like save his like crippled daughter or something? I don't, I still don't exactly know what's going on. And then he like found like these bugs in the cave that had like their poison had like regenerative properties. So we thought that like maybe he could like regenerate his daughter's Ail injuries or ailments or like just bring her back from the dead or something like I I don't know Maybe Marlene was like the first like human test subject that he's actually had some success with or Twenty one oh nine All right, here we go. Like we've already stumbled upon a lot of shit here. We haven't even made it down to the amusement park yet. Is this, is this gonna be a boss battle? Bro, is that Marlene? Get the fucking chills. Oh my god. Dude, that has that has to be Marlene. What the fuck? Marlene. Should I put her out of misery? Nah, let's leave her up here, bro. Let's just leave her alone.
Yeah. Oh my god, dude. We gotta crawl out the walls and shit. What's what's up with that one? Alright, so we apparently destroyed Frederick's house. That is gonna come out of our pay. Try to find the damn dude and uh, we blew up his house, so. I would say that this case is not off to a great start. Oh, the little policeman, uh, tiny town guy, whatever the fuck it's. <laughs> well, I can't remember what those things are called. Like, Playmobil. Playmobil! Okay, so we destroyed the bad guy's lair. Case, case closed, right? Oh shit! Not case closed. I guess I could have just run past these guys instead of wasting my ammo, but what? They're not dying. I'm a not. Nah, I better not. I feel like I get a lot more ammo than I get health packs. So now we just run off into the, like, you seriously just did not bring a cell phone? I can't remember what stupid reason they gave for not bringing a cell phone. Like, I, you know, like there weren't supposed to be any digital communications, but come on, bro. seeing faces in the trees, man. Oh, this is a... This is a really beautiful night, though. The fog. The amusement park. I, uh, dude, you read in the file that, like, the amusement park was involved. Like, were they just busting kids in here? Or, like... It's like... Uh, how... How are they... <laughs> How are they even getting out here in the first place? Like, what amusement park is this? Like, do they advertise for this shit? Or is it like a, if you know, you know, kind of thing where you just like, yeah, there's this amusement park in the woods. Oh man, I love it though. It's cool. This is really cool. I'm assuming the amusement park is probably part three. Okay, I am going to get to the next phone and I am going to call this video. I don't want to spoil any more of it. Uh, this is actually kind of a cool game. I feel like people will probably like this one a lot. So let me just find another phone. I'm going to call my ride and we are going to get the hell out of here. What is this place though? It's very vibey, very vibey. There we go. There we go. No trespassing. This property is protected by video surveillance. Trespassers will be turned into a mannequin. All right. If I if I didn't know any better, I'd say this is a fucking boss arena. I don't think they would have a boss in this game, would they? Can I turn on the cement mixer? Can I mix some cement? So where exactly am I going now that I'm in here? I guess probably to the other end of this facility. Whoop. Whoop. Uh, do I get a, oh man, is it a forklift mini game? Oh, I don't get to drive this thing. I was kind of thinking that they're going to make me drive this thing. Move these containers out of the way here. Yeah, because there's like... That arrow is very pointedly like pointing in that direction. Unless... That's just an asset. That might be the case. Okay, let's see if I can get around here. I'm about to break this game. Alright. Alright, we're getting somewhere. 
Was that intentional? I don't know. I'm not so certain what I'm like, where I'm supposed to. Oh, I think we should uh, follow the sign and not enter. Oh my God, is this an RE4 fucking minecart level? Let's go, let's go. I mean, surely there wouldn't be any mannequins down in the mine, right? Uh-oh, maybe there would be. Maybe there would be. Damn, this is gonna be a whole ass thing. There's no phone here. Okay. Looks like, you're, <laughs> looks like we're good. That is a fucking eyeball. No. God. There's the fucking heebie jeebies again. Oh, this. This game, dude, is giving me the chills. Eyeball spiders. Oh man, where's the phone? I just need to. I need to call for my ride. I see another one off there in the distance. There. I wonder what they. I don't even want to give them the opportunity to do anything to me. No. Why aren't they dying? Why aren't they dying? Shit, they're actually gonna kill me. They're gonna kill me. Why are those things the hardest enemies in the game? Oh God, okay. I got lucky there. I think I used my last health pack. I'm out of small first aid. I am out of large first aid kits. I'm out of large first aid kits. All right, so that means we're we're on our own now. Those things just don't want to fucking die. Oh. Oh, thank God. Okay, let me just do just a little more exploring in this like immediate area real quick to see if there are any items I can find before I sign off here just see what we're dealing with okay like the mine is actually like a whole part let me just double check down this way oh, no, man I'm curious now okay another padlock all right cool I know what we're dealing with we've got to go down that way to get a padlock code I'm assuming guys so this is jack holmes master of puppets uh this game is a lot more brutal than i thought it was gonna be this game is actually i'm having a pretty good time with it it's pretty fucking scary it's like a genuine horror game like i know like a lot of game, like a lot of horror games by indie devs nowadays are like again like those psx horror games or like just like straight up like trash horror games or like chase em ups and like phasmo games but like this is a straight actual classic survival horror game um, same with like that Pine, ha Pine Harbor, uh, uh, people are actually doing some really cool, like survival horror games now. I'm, I'm all for it. Uh, go ahead and check this one out right now. I think it's on sale for like, it's like an, at an introductory price of like 11.99 or 12.99, but I think ordinarily like full price, the game's like 15 bucks so far. I'd say it's like pretty well worth it if you're like a survival horror junkie. But other than that, yeah, check this game out. Um, it's pretty fucking cool. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.